Today, both teams are competing to see which foods go in their one color smoothie, but only one smoothie can be good. Each team will go through a challenge and the winning team has to put the good food in the blender, while the losing team has to put the bad food in theirs. Who will have the worst smoothie? Let's find out. Are you guys ready for your first challenge? Okay. We're ready. So I have this lovely jar of Skittles. You guys need to guess how many Skittles are in this jar. Dude, I'm okay? so bad at this. The winner gets the good items, the loser gets the bad items. Oh That's my gosh, it. it's heavy. Okay. I I think Brent's gonna be really bad. He's gonna say like 20. I don't think he understands. No, no, there's definitely more than 20. I'm gonna do 987. 400. There are exactly 1,232 Skittles in this jar. Okay, we still won though, we still won. Are you ready to see your good food? I'm excited. Oh yeah. Here we go. Oh! oh blueberries! That's like a perfect thing for a smoothie. Blueberries into the good smoothie. Oh. I can take the reject. Do they sell like- I can I can take it up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> and let's uh, let's reveal this bad let's item. Let's do it. Shall we? What is oh. that? So this right here, red hot Cheeto mac and cheese. Oh. Oh. Yummy. Dude, in a blender? Yum. Ugh. That's gonna be blended Dude, up. That's gonna be so gross. <laughs> but let's put it in our bad smoothie. Put it in. Don't worry, bro. We're not gonna drink that's it. We're gonna win. Oh yeah. In the smoothie it goes. Want to come out? Ew! It's literally stuck. That's gonna make your smoothie super spicy. Get out of here. Please. All right. So we're in good shape here with blueberries. We're in great shape. For challenge number two, you guys have two minutes to finish as many talkies as possible. Two minutes starts now. Okay. Go 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 go. Okay, go. here we go. Mm. All right. Oh. They're munching. They're crunching. Oh, oh he's got it's a really handful. Fuzzy. Let's go, oh Ashley. Ah. Oh my God! They're going crazy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, two at a time. Woo! <laughs> It must be oh. pretty spicy. I'm getting hot just watching them. How are they doing that? They are taking handfuls. Oh! To pick up the base. Oh, oh. oh it's spicy! First of all, the blue ones are spicier than the red ones. Guys, comment down below if the blue ones are spicier. They definitely are. Oh no! Oh my god! I need a blueberry. Oh, oh. Oh, hi, hi, hi. oh my gosh! My mouth. No. One minute <laughs> remaining. Are not too hot. Go! You got it! You got it! Let's really go! <laughs> <laughs> It's just covered. I have to win. I need a win. Ten. Nine. Keep it going. Keep it going. All right. Here we go. And five. Ashton, we're almost done. Four. One. Three. Two. One. Let's go. Oh. You're done. We win. My finger, look at my hands and my tongue. <sighs> All right. This bowl is feeling a little lighter. Red team wins. Yes. yes. Let's go. Let's, go. <laughs> Let's reveal your good item. All right. Let's see. Ooh. Yes, healthy. Oh, that's I like solid. It. Apple a day. Keeps, Keeps the, doctor the doctor away. That's right. Two, uh, one. Oh. What? Oh. what? What the hell are those? Blue hard boiled eggs. Ew! How'd you even get these blue? We have our ways. Those are way worse than this mac and cheese. This is oh, no. cheating. They're not blue. Hey, you guys should be grateful. One egg is six grams of protein. So we got 24 grams right here. For this challenge, we are bobbing for apples. Woo! Woo! Okay. Oh, my apples aren't blue. Maybe. Don't worry about it. So if you get a ping pong ball, that's one point. If you get an apple, it's five. You got 30 seconds though. Dom is our guy. All right, Ashley, I'm just like, dude, you got I got this, I trust you to get oh all got it. I got Let's go, bro. You got 30 this, bro. seconds starts hey, now. Let's go, Ashton. Nice. One apple down. Keep going. Faster. Nice. Keep going. Keep, you got it, you got it. Yep. Let's go. 10 seconds. 10 seconds, bro. Keep going, keep going. Dom is struggling. Dom is struggling. Go. Go. Bro, keep going. Big five balls. Keep going. Slurp them up. <laughs> Ow! Oh, we won for sure. Bro, you guys, no, you did not win. I'm going to count Team Red. All right, here we go. Looks like they have one apple. Yep, that's, that's five. five points. 20, 21, 22, 23. Let's go, 23. 23 for Team Red. 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. 23. 24. Oh, yeah. Bro, you guys so won by one. So, blue team won this last round. Let's go. see what their good item is. Dude, oh, uh, I don't think that's a good what? idea. That is not real. What, what is that? Wait, think about is this a banana? Well, yes. <laughs> you guys soaked a banana Listen, in food this... coloring? What is wrong with you? <laughs> it's edible. How dare you do that to such a high, uh, uh, what does bananas have? Uh, potassium? Potassium fruit. <laughs> we love potassium, not when it's blue. <laughs> Let's see what you guys got. All right. Oh, that's not bad. Dude, just hot Cheetos. Why? That is definitely we're gonna, bad. We're have, like, you guys got the bad item. At what point would you put hot Cheetos oh. in a blender? We're gonna have like the spiciest smoothie ever. We're gonna have hot Cheetos. All right. 
There we go, not so bad. Okay guys, you have 15 minutes to make a burger with your color. So get creative, make it look pretty. 15 minutes on the clock starts now. All right, go. Pop it in All right, 15 minutes. Let's pop that burger on. Let's cook that burger, huh? Listen to that baby You hear that? Sizzle. We're gonna make the ketchup blue because no one's ever seen blue ketchup before. It's creative, it's new, they're gonna love it. Oh my God. Let's get the burger on. Yep, burger's going on right now. We already have the advantage because the meat is red and the tomatoes are red. We're getting creative over here. Yeah, it looks good. <laughs> oh my God. That actually looks pretty cool. We need Why like, do I feel like these two have never cooked anything in their life? Well, well Liv, we made pancake art together. Yeah. Yeah. That's not You clearly food. didn't watch the video. That's not, no. I don't know why this is so funny watching Dom cook. This just like doesn't make sense to me. I feel like Dom's also never cooked in his life. What do you mean? Now that's some blue cheese. Did you just drop it? Fred, are you kidding me? It's falling apart. I will make another one. They are struggling over there. Do not see it's cooking. Me. Jeez, that was on the floor. I'm making you a new one, okay? Yeah. Sorry, Chef. Sorry, right, Chef. Ooh, look at that. Look at that. Look at that. <laughs> that looks so weird. Five minutes remaining. Okay, oh my god, Brian, we need to make okay, this blue so cheese. All right, I got it. I'm just gonna have to take that. <laughs> Blue cheese on the burger. I don't think that's what they mean by blue cheese. Wait. All right, we're good. Liv loves pickles. Woo, okay, I think we should start building the actual. Okay, all right, let's take these off. Let's take these off. One minute. Bam, perfect. Nice, boom, just like that. I'm and three. Okay, good, good, that looks good. So he's trying to make a smiley. Oh, oh, 30 seconds. 30 seconds, you guys need to hurry. This is, I think, the world's first blue tomato. <laughs> God. Okay, yeah, that's good. 10, pickles. nine, uh, yeah, eight, 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 eight. Pickles on. seven, six, slow and steady, slow and steady, slow and steady. Bam, four, two, three, three. Okay, that's two, two and one, you're done. Oh. Hands off the burger. Woo. I'm gonna be honest, I just don't wanna eat any of these. <laughs> <laughs> it is time to rate your masterpieces. Well, let me just admire it for a second. This is a five star establishment, is it not? I well, mean, how does a burger make you feel usually? Good. Happy, right? Yes. Good. Exactly. Ah, uh, so what's the name of your restaurant? Smurf and Turf. <laughs> oh, that's good. <laughs> that was quick. Okay, here we have the bun. Mm -hmm. Noted. Really cute. Oh, I can see that the bun is toasted. We, we toasted, toasted the bun. bun. Hard to tell because it's blue, but we did put it. No, I can feel it. I can feel it. Okay. Here we go. Let's see what the inside looks like. Wow. Ooh. Wow. Okay. Wow. Just wow. That is a That's blue. That's the only burger. word I have for this. And look at wow. that. The blue juice is coming out. Hey, Liv. Let's not get too excited. Let's remember we have the best burger over here. Okay. Okay. I just want you to enjoy that bite. Just really take it all in there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh wow! Are they blue? Yeah, how a little taste? bit. It tastes like a burger. Yes, it that's good. what we were going for. Let's go. If you had your eyes covered and someone fed you this burger, would you have predicted that this burger was blue? No. Oh really? That's, no, that's good. So I, it's fun I, to look at, and it tastes like a normal burger. I enjoyed it. I don't enjoy what happened with my teeth, but. I enjoy this. Okay. Please explain your, your masterpiece. So, so this is called the whole lot of red burger. We have red bun, mm. red ketchup and tomato, mm. mm -hmm. red pickles, mm -hmm. and it was made with love. Oh, that's the best part. I know. And look at that. You told us medium. That looks yeah. medium rare to me. I think so. Uh, you got my it's, order. It's a spray paint. I think, yeah, it's a spray, spray paint. paint. Oh, is it? It's giving it like Sorry. an illusion. Oh, okay, yeah. okay. Here we go. You're right. Three, two, one. Mmm. Mm. Whole lot of red. Mm -hmm. Can't go wrong. Taste-wise, they're the exact same. You use the same ingredients, you well, just spray them was, in different ways. Ours colors. was with love. Before you messed ours up, it looked decent. Whoa, that's a, I'm gonna remember a, that. Yeah. Wait, this you is better watch your mouth. Yeah, yeah. watch how you talk to me. Well, Liv, don't mind him saying that. He was just kidding. I was okay. kidding. He was just joking. Was joking. Okay. <laughs> April Fools. I think I made my decision. All right. Oh my Let's go. God. I like the bun on this. It's splotchy and kind of like artsy. She started with yours, which means that she's gonna come and say ours, and then she's gonna say we're the winner. Now you're just assuming work. stuff. Well, watch this. But <laughs> this blue burger over here. I had a smiley face. Yes, I told and, you. Hey, whoa, 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 hold on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> and they really sold me with the happiness. Um, that made good. me feel good. Blue team wins. Yeah! Yeah! Let's go. Yeah! Blue team, blue team, you blue team, blue team. Young man. <laughs> hey, 
I'll spray you. Oh, you, oh. do it. Oh, Why do you diss the judge? Out of all idea. people, you diss the judge? This video gets 30K likes, and Ash and Ash have to spray their teeth red. Wait, oh my what? God. Okay, so let's see Blue Team's good item. Oh. What? Are those blue Pop-Tarts? <laughs> what? This entire Pop-Tart is literally blue. Okay, and now for the red team, your bad item is... What is that? It's Hot Cheeto scrambled egg. Why is everything Hot Cheeto? Oh, <laughs> they literally have nothing but Hot Cheetos in there. Because they want you to suffer. <laughs> All right, Hot oh, that Cheeto looks so bad. Okay. Um, oh, hot uh, that's disgusting. Hot scrambled egg. So in order to blend your smoothies, you guys are gonna need some liquids. You guys won. You had the good item, so you get the good yeah. I'm about liquid milk. <laughs> to blend this, and that's milk. That's some good liquid right there. Quality liquid. And then you guys get habanero pepper soda. Oh, oh my god. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah. Dude, theirs is gonna be so spicy. That's that is spicy. habanero pepper soda. It's like the opposite of quality liquid. Here we go. Good liquid, good liquid, good liquid, <laughs> good liquid. Only oh, the tornado. <laughs> the tornado, baby. Blending. Would be good. Uh, like, no. It would be a strawberry. No, smoothie. no, no, no. But there's not a single but strawberry in there. <laughs> this is so gross. I don't know. It's <laughs> bubbling. <laughs> Dude, ours smells kind of good. Yeah, it does. It literally just smells like blueberries. It smells that like a blueberry bad. smoothie. Wait, take a whiff. Take a whiff. <laughs> smell it. Wait, is it that baby? Bad? Oh my gosh. Smell it. Smell it. Smell it. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that is gonna taste so bad. It's spicy. Oh my god. Ew, it's chunky. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, blueberry smoothie. Yo, this actually looks pretty good. I would never think to put a pop tart in a smoothie, but like, it actually seems like it's gonna be good. Cheers. Yeah, <laughs> it's actually not bad. Yeah? It just tastes like blueberry. All right. Oh my gosh, that's really it's good. It's good, right? Oh my god, it's so good. Try it. Nice. Let me try it. Yo, that's actually like refreshing. It, it tastes almost a little bit tropical, you know? Yeah, a little pop tarty. Mm -hmm. It's not bad. All right. Blueberry banana action. Oh, I'm so glad I'm not the one drinking that. Let me try it. And then we have. This drink of Ooh, death. Oh. It smells so bad. <sighs> Three, dude, go! Oh, oh my god! Oh, 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 We're in Japan. We spent a ton of money getting here, so for today we only have a hundred dollars for our budget for food. But we're just gonna eat at convenience stores, and luckily for us, they are everywhere. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day, and Liv and I are here at 7-Eleven. And we're hungry, and we need caffeine. Let's ASAP. see if they have some coffee. Update, they have a coffee machine. And we don't know where the cups are, we don't know how to read. Oh, we might be out of luck. You know, maybe they already have a pre-made coffee. That'd be good. All right, Liv, let's make a plan, okay? okay. I'll look for breakfast drinks, like coffee, juice, and mm -hmm. you look for breakfast mm -hmm. foods. Okay, any uh, recommendations? Um, you know, I like a croissant, cool. something a little sweet. Oh, okay. Great job. Okay, let's go. Splits. Okay, I have found the pre-made coffee selection. Look at how cute this little thing is. I like my coffee sweets, just like me. I'm just kidding. But I do like my coffee sweet, so these all look very milky and very sweet, so I don't think I can go wrong with anything here. This one says sweetened. It's like medium sweet. I want like very sweet. This is the one I'm gonna go with. It is all the way sweet. Hopefully Liv likes her coffee sweet, because I'm gonna get her one of these. Okay, so my mission is to find breakfast food. I'm not a huge breakfast girl, but I do know it's important, so. We got octopus dumplings. That doesn't sound appetizing. Put that back. Oh, just a slab of chicken. No, thank you. Oh, protein yogurt. Okay, gains. We got lemon. We got blueberry. I think blueberry is the way to go. And let's try the lemon. They have a pretty large variety of smoothies and all of these smoothies look very crazy to me. I'm used to like the OG Jamba Juice, but these are crazy. The mango blend looks so good. I mean, <laughs> they have ice cream. That's tempting, but then the no, we're looking for nutritious breakfast. Oh, they got little baby hogging dogs. Green tea? Ugh. No, for later. Stop it. Don't look at me like that. Don't look at me. Stop looking at me like that. No. Japan is known for their matcha, so I think we have to get a matcha this morning. Honey. Lexi said a pastry croissant. Oh, look at this. Okay. I don't know about 
got a pork sausage. This looks like a mochi donut. That's breakfast, right? She said something sweet. So let's add this to the cart. Okay, I'm getting a little distracted. I found a ton of beauty products. I kind of want to try something. Lexi's very into beauty, so maybe she might want me to get some of this. I kind of got distracted. I found some beauty products. Huh. Are we going to eat these for breakfast? No, but after we eat, you know, we got to get ready for the day ready okay yeah, yeah that's what i was kind of thinking well i'm not gonna lie some of this stuff looks pretty crazy i know but i'm like interested to try it it doesn't hurt to try it yeah, never know. let's just do this little sheet mask maybe one of these like a little face mask after breakfast. Okay, I have found these cute little seaweed rice balls. And I feel like that's a very Japanese breakfast. We gotta kind of venture outside of an American breakfast, right? We're in Japan. Let's try grilled salmon, egg and soy sauce, and maybe some chicken veggie soy sauce. I think I'm all set. I'm gonna go find Lexi. I don't know if you forgot, but we have a budget of $100 for the entire day. Oh. Did you forget that? Yeah. Because I did too. I got us both a Wait, latte. Wait, are so cute. And they like how they come with a little oh, oh wow sweetness is it's yeah. up there. Sorry, I like my coffee sweet. I got us a matcha because we have to try matcha. Oh yeah. But Liv, I'm a little worried that this alone might be a hundred dollars. I think you're right. I think we have to take stuff out. Like what? Maybe the skincare since we can't eat these. <laughs> Good point. Also one of these yogurts. Yeah, I don't really like yogurt all that much. There, I'll go put this back. Okay. $1,400. Well, hold on. What, what does this convert that? to? Oh, what? Okay. Looks like we only spent 10 bucks. $10. So, pretty good. Pretty good. It's time for breakfast. Yeah. I think I'm most excited for the matcha. I'm excited for the really sweet latte. Mm. We had a long day of travel yesterday, so we need some good nutrition. Yeah. I wouldn't necessarily call no. balls and rice nutritional. <laughs> Let's start with the drinks. Okay. I think I've just stabbed through this. One. Nope. Oh. <laughs> All right. Cheers. Cheers. Update, we were just informed that we cannot try foods. So we're getting kicked out. All right, we have our breakfast food here. It's a pretty nutritional breakfast. We have some rice, coffee, protein, donut, caffeine. We have everything. I think we should start with the drinks first. So I agree. Sweet latte. Creamy matcha. Okay, so cheers. cheers. That's really sweet. Mine's very strong. Coffee strong? Like coffee strong. I'd probably like it then. I'm not try. a huge fan of like coffee that tastes like coffee. Oh. Like I like coffee that tastes like sugar. So you're not a fan of coffee? I don't think I am. All right, I kind of like how Japanese drinks are like this, where you gotta kind of stab it. They're it's just, fun. it's fun. Oh, shoot. There we go. That's not strong to me. What? <laughs> That's like actually really sweet yeah, to see, me. The mango blend. This box for the smoothie is unlike anything I've ever seen before in the United States. This is how I'm gonna look after I yeah. drink this drink. This is our inspiration here. She's goals. Oh my god. It's good? So good. Okay, 7-Eleven. Mm -hmm. I can't believe all of this oh was $9. God. That was really cheap. Mm -hmm. We took stuff out of our basket because we were afraid that it would cost too much money. We're good. We are good. What right. do you want? Egg yolk? Wait, there's egg yolk inside <laughs> of this? <laughs> I got grilled salmon. Oh my god, mine smells so good. Okay. Gotta get to the salmon. Just too. some rice in here. I don't want to get to the egg. <laughs> There's not a lot of salmon. Maybe I'm just not there yet. No, that's really small, huh? It's a lot of rice. A lot of rice. I could sit here all day and eat this. <laughs> you like it. Mm -hmm. This is good. Next, we got the sugar coating mochi donut. I like the sound of that. Ooh, oh, like wet feeling. Okay, like, very squishy. All here right. We go. Oh my god. I feel like I just ate a sugar cube. <laughs> yeah, that is sweet. You said sweet. It's so chewy. It's not a normal donut. It's a mochi donut. It's really gummy. It's pretty good. I don't think it's the best for you. No. Probably not a nutritious breakfast, but whatever. And unfortunately, I don't think I can have this yogurt because I forgot a spoon. It is what it is. It's fine. Well, I'm ready for lunch. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we want to lunch. So Liv and I tried pretty much everything except for the yogurt because we didn't have a spoon. <laughs> but honestly, for nine dollars, almost ten dollars, oh, yeah. this was a. It was good. We got so much stuff. This was like a breakfast buffet. What would you rate it? Like everything total. Yeah. I'm giving it a, a nine. Breakfast Whoa. Is, yeah, breakfast is a nine. Oh, it's up there. Okay. Yeah, I was leaning more towards like eight. Okay. But for the price, that's actually insane. Yeah. So Liv and I are gonna walk around, hang out a little bit until we get hungry for lunch, and then we're gonna stop by another convenience store. Don't you worry. <laughs> we will be there again. <laughs> we'll be back. So we're walking around 
trying to find a place to sit and eat lunch, but this is so pretty. This is so cute. They've got all these cute little plants. Look at the little tiny. Why do I feel like if you had a plant, you'd kill it in a day? <laughs> Uh, that's not true. I don't know about that. Liv and I were just getting ready to eat our lunch somewhere and then we saw cherry blossoms. You guys, look at these. They're beautiful! There they are, in all their glory. Thank you. Yeah. We're sitting in the park, but I want you guys to get a load of this chair. This isn't a bench, this is a single person bench. Things are pretty small in Tokyo and we're pretty small gal. French fries. Why not? And they gave us ketchup. So let's try these. Okay. This ketchup looks a little wacko. Alright, let's try this. This ketchup's weird. Really? Try the ketchup. <gasps> right? Why is it like sour? It's sour. Like, it's tangy. I'm good with that. These are good. The french fries are pretty yeah. good. <laughs> Liv got... This is plum. I've never seen anything like this, so... Liv got plum. I just got rice and seaweed. All right. Okay, here we go. Mm. Hmm. Oh, I thought it was good and then it automatically wasn't. I'm kind of confused by mine. Something doesn't taste right. <laughs> These weren't as good as the first no. rice balls we got. My breakfast rice was much better. Okay. Oh, 7-Eleven has wipes. sanitary wipes. But okay. no chopsticks. Just like the spoon and the yogurt. We don't learn from these things. Now this looks a little terrifying. <laughs> I have no idea what this is. But these are kind of cute oh. and little. I'm going to be trying the jasmine milk tea. It's I got to the center of it and it was like sweet. I don't know what that is. This is good. I think that might be like fruit in there. Yeah. Looks like there's a sponge. I don't know. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's sponge. <laughs> so it's a Spongebob sushi roll. Okay. Here she goes. Here we go. What does it taste like? I think that's like a tofu. Oh, kind of okay, yeah. Ish. I'm gonna move on. The sushi from 7-Eleven is a little interesting. I don't know about that. Don't try that at home. Liv and I also got some chips. Now, since we can't read any of the words on the packaging, we're kind of going oh. in this blind. They're like baby french fries. These are good. That's good. They're like spicy french fry chips. We also got pizza chips. Whoa, this smells <laughs> like a pepperoni pizza. Oh my god. Okay, let's see if and they taste cheese. like one. It tastes like pizza. But why are they kind of sweet? Yeah. I'm kind of thrown off. There's like salt and pepper on them too. I don't know. So what I'm to getting think. sour cream. Mm -hmm. I'm kind of confused. I don't really know what to think. These are better for sure. Yeah. Okay, if I had to give lunch a rating overall, I'm giving lunch a six. Only because I didn't love the sushi we got. I'm still kind of hungry. I don't know if these are going to tide me over. These are going to have to. Because we didn't really eat the sushi or the rice bowl. Yeah. I think we're going to have to stop and get a snack. We'll be back. We'll don't be back. you worry. Don't you worry. <laughs> we had our very first family mart of the day. It's yeah. another convenience store. It's a 7 Eleven. It's a little bit different so let's go check it out yeah so Liv and I have a little challenge for ourselves we thought that it would be fun to get a bunch of food from here and try to trick Brent and make him think that it's not from a convenience store and that it's like gourmet food and there's good food here so I think we can pull it off but yeah. we can't forget about the budget oh yeah we spent $25 yeah. we found something that looks pretty gourmet and it's not even cooked yet yeah I don't know what this swirly thing is I think we that. get this maybe a drink and that's that. gourmet guys it doesn't get any more gourmet than that we just found a full set of fancy desserts. Look at this. It's like a, a crepe. That looks like a delicacy. A crepe. Oh, what? A crepe? <laughs> what are you saying? What's <laughs> 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 that? This sounds fancier. A crepe and macarons. So Brent's allergic to these nuts. And this is a pistachio macaron. So let's give it to him. Yes. <laughs> no, we want him to live, right? Hopefully this doesn't have nuts, we'll find out. So we were looking for a fancy beverage. We found champagne and it's wild because this is, I think, under $10. But this Look looks this. like it could be over $100, this mm -hmm. bottle. He's in for a treat. Yeah. Liv and I were picking out some things for Brent's dinner and we kind of came to the realization, why does he get dinner and we don't? Yeah, what? I mean, what were we thinking? I don't know. Like, we have the budget. Let's go pick out some stuff for dinner. Sounds great to me. And dessert. 100%. Yeah, dessert. <laughs> I found this. This wow. looks pretty good. I think this is the best sushi that we've seen in all of the convenience stores. Yeah. Better so. than the 7-Elevens. Thank you, Family Mart. Yeah. Update, they just told us we can't film in here. So just to let you guys know, we're getting our desserts and we're heading out. Okay, so our total in there was 6,630 yen, which is approximately $43. So we did pretty good. So that's the $70. most we've spent. And we still had money to spare because it's about $70. So yeah. we kind of killed that. We can come back here later. If For we more to. dessert. For more. You guys, I'm <laughs> we definitely sick good. Of convenience stores. I'm not. You're not I, done I, yet? No. There's so well, much in there. Yeah, I'm on All right. Let's do it. Right. We have to. Oh,
The last boat to sink wins. There are three teams who have one hour to build a boat out of anything they can find. With crazy challenges, freezing cold temperatures, and $1,000 on the line, you wouldn't believe how it all ends. So we're in front of Home Depot. Everyone has one hour to build their boat, so you have to be quick in the store. They're easy. Oh, I already know how to build this. But, Tom, we got it. But you only have $200 to spend in Home Depot. Wait, what? Yeah, only $200? That's more than enough. That's it's easy. Um, that's easy. Uh, no, it's not. Know. All right, 200? well, you guys better go because the timer starts now. All right, so first things first, we need a cart. All right, grab a cart. Yeah. Bro, not that cart. Dom, it's gonna be fun. No, no, a regular, actually, let's grab this. No, 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 go, 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 go. Okay, so we were just trying to find a cart and we need something big enough, and I think Brian found it. I found it. That's massive. I don't know if we need that. I'm a massive guy, the boat has to be big. Yeah, I have an idea. What if we bought something that could sabotage one of the other teams, like a cinder block? Are we allowed to do that? I don't know. Should no, they, do they didn't say that we couldn't do Should it. Should we do it? It's two bucks. Imagine this, right? We get a rope, we tie the rope to the cinder block like a banker. Yeah, and then we tie it onto one of their, the, the boats. It sinks. Okay, let's do it. Oh, wait, actually, you know what? That might ruin the bottom of my pool. I just thought about that. That's a concern. Yeah, we probably don't want to do that. <laughs> this boat we're about to build, we could go in the ocean with it. We could catch waves with it. That's how wait, good this boat's about to be. I've never built a boat. I don't know what I'm going to do. Do okay, you know wait. how to build a boat? Okay, we got to think. Okay, what floats? What floats? I mean, empty bottles float. We could literally get something like this, empty it out, and like tape it. Dom, like, no, Bro, no. Just, listen, listen, listen. listen. If, no. we, if we empty this out, it floats. No, it does not. Yes, it does. It's plastic. Is just one of these? We have a $200 limit, and no, this no, is we, about $30. Okay, okay, something cheaper, something cheaper. But you know what I'm saying? Like something like that. I think first things first, we need like a foundation. We need like something we can like stand on or sit yeah. on. Yeah. These are like drywall boards, right? We want like foam. Uh oh. This is not what we're looking for. What do we do? Can we do the unthinkable? Ask the employee. I think we have to. Oh, this is this, this is, is it. Perfect. This is it. All right, sick. We got it. Let's do it. Bro, and it looks cool too. It's yeah, like, it's sick. Should we get like multiple of them? I mean, it's yeah, better too. to be safe than sorry. We'll do too. So we're gonna put these on top of the uh, the bins as like a platform that we're gonna be able to like sit on. Yeah, and then we're gonna put the turf on top of this uh -huh. to make it look good. Yeah. All right, guys, our boat's coming along. No way, the other teams have a better idea than us. There's just no way. Maybe some like plastic. I feel like plastic floats pretty well. Plastic. Or do you think we should go all wood? Um, if we went wood, we're gonna need to nail things together. That sounds dangerous. We can try it. We can Have try you it. built anything in your life? Like Ikea furniture and, and stuff. I've, I've put together an air fryer. We're doomed. What have you built? A career. Some guy just came up to us and told us that our foam that we bought would 100% sink in the water. If you take the, um, the aluminum off of it, yeah. it just turns to styrofoam powder. It's gone. What about these? They're denser, but if you support it, it'll be okay. But it's just that stuff like as soon as you peel that off, Gone. And he told us this one would be a lot better. So we're gonna get this one instead. We gotta get like a ton of these. These have to cover our whole platform. Shout out to the guy that gave us some tips because yeah. if we didn't know that, we would have got the other one and that could have broken. And yeah, Ashton would have been at the bottom of the pool. Tell me this doesn't look like a roll of bubble gum. I just wanna eat it. Eat it. <laughs> All right, now it's duct tape time. If you don't know how to build stuff, just buy duct tape. Yeah, it'll put anything you want together. This can be our paddle. So we can like kind of like paddle around. And, that? Like, and I can take down the other teams. That's yeah. massive. No, I think it'll work. We're in the cutting section. We are lost. I'm Dude, getting... we're on a time crunch. We gotta go. I'm sorry, okay. Come okay. on. Okay. You're stressing me out. Okay, I'm pushing here. You gotta direct me. We need me. to win. Do you know what You're we... not being a good co-pilot. Listen. Are we fighting right we, now? We gotta put our Take that back. <laughs> we gotta put our take it back. aside. We have a thousand dollars to focus we have on. A, we have a thousand dollars. What is this we, for? We, we, that we won't fight anymore. All right, no more fighting. <laughs> no more fighting. I think Liv is asking a worker right now, so. All right, so he said the biggest plastic they have is out in the gardening section. That's car park. This? Oh, okay, Excuse not me. there. We were in this aisle first, no, and then you're just trying to snipe. Does Ashton care, though? No, no, no I don't. You sure? Leave it, it's not worth Ashton, it. Do we want this? It's not worth it? It's not worth it. Want you see what they just did? We found this first. Come on. Maybe we don't want it anymore. Oh my god, okay. We literally don't have anything, but we're gonna need tape. You're right, I've seen the commercials before. Flex tape. Dude, what? I was thinking Gorilla tape. You slap it on and it makes everything work perfectly. Trust me, we're gonna need this for sure. I don't okay. know what we're taping yet, but this is good tape. Dom, do you know how much the tape is? What? $20 for two. What? Dude, so that's like half down. our budget. Yep. Are you kidding me? We have $180 left to spend. Dom, we have no time. Okay, okay, go, 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 go. I think we're the only team that's outside right now, so we might have an advantage here. <laughs> we're hey. losing time. We are wasting time. Let's go uh, get that plastic bin. Uh, just a bin? Yeah. I don't think I don't think that'll carry me. Oh, 
it's so pretty. Oh, I like this one. Liv! What? We gotta focus. Oh no! We're let's wasting go, let's time. Let's go, let's go, let's go. All right, so me and Dom are currently looking down the aisles. I don't know what to even make or build because I've never even done this. And it looks like none of these supplies are gonna work. I think we should have gone to a pool store for this. Guys, it's been five minutes and all we have in our cart is literally two things of duct tape. Why, why do we even have a cart? Like we should just carry yeah. it. Like we need to save time. All right, Ben, this is really, this is gonna work. It's gonna work. Are you sure that's for me? Now we need a big one because Brian is large. And I'm not saying that you're fat. I weigh 180. Okay, so, so we need something to hold up 180 pounds. Pure muscle. Uh-huh. I say this. It's already built for us. Work uh, smarter, not harder. You know what I'm saying? If I sit in this in the water, I feel like it's just gonna sink. Okay, Liv, I'm thinking two smaller bins on the side for like little air pockets. And then like a smaller one in the middle that I can sit on. Um, and then rope kind of like cut to help tie it all together. I'm thinking this one. Oh yeah, this is good. Let's do let's do these. Really? Yeah, on the sides, I'm, I'm thinking. So no water gets in. We gotta get a tool so we can cut through the plastic, and then we also gotta get rope. we need lids. Yes. I don't know where we're at with this budget, but there's too many things to focus on. The time, the budget, how to build this boat. We gotta get a really powerful fox cutter. Oh, oh, hey whoa, guys. Whoa, whoa, whoa. You guys, your guys' car is looking a little dry, I'm not gonna lie. Wait, let's not show them our car. You guys are gonna interfere with what we're doing for the second time? The first time, all right, second, you have some. The audacity. Liv, what's going on over here? All right. I think she's a little butthurt that like, you know, we obviously have a better boat so far. Mm, what's your game plan? Well, we're not gonna tell you. We just need some duct tape. So. They're gonna tell me because it's uh, I'm gonna need you to uh, Can't wait decide. to watch you sink. Oh, uh, can't wait to watch you guys sink. They're gonna definitely need some of this because because their boat is gonna be a hazard to get even on it. Caution. Yeah, I'm getting a little worried because I have not seen Ashton or Dom once yet. Bro, this could be perfect. Dom, you're in the wrong section. Dude, this could be this perfect, bro. Well, sink up. First things first, can we fit in here? All right, let's see. All right, Dom. This is perfect. Wait, does that count if we sit like that? This counts. That yeah. could work. That could literally and work. And I can get a tan line while enjoying the boat. And then if we have things that float all the way around, yeah. dude, that would yeah, actually work. That. that would actually right. work. We're on to something, Dom. Okay. And these are cheap. These dude, are only $10. That's perfect. They're actually screwed. All of them. Are. They are done. I mean, we're, look at Lynch. Okay, so update. Brian is trying to find something for a paddle. Some sort of something we can put on the end of the stick. Yeah, we need a hammer. Wait, why? You'll see. All I want is just, I just want the $1,000, so I'll just kind of <laughs> sit back and hope for the best. You know, and worse comes to worse, even if we lose, I get the satisfaction of watching Brian drown. <laughs> I did not mean that, <laughs> but seriously. Okay, just in case I can't find nails, I'm gonna get some zip ties. I'm thinking for the ends of the paddle. Great, that's what I was thinking. You know, Should zip we? ties seem like the way to go, because we can put like five of these bad boys on that. And then maybe duct tape it or rope it. Let's get duct tape. Forget the nails, forget the hammer, you know? We don't want to hurt ourselves. Duct Definitely tape, have. and then honestly, we're, we're good. We're good. Okay, we're good. Oh, Ashley, we have to hurry. Oh my God, dude, wait. hey, we have to find the tape. Wait, it's right here. Is that not tape? Oh, that is tape. Oh, okay. We're looking at it the whole time. We need the heaviest duty they got. Oh, aqua seal tape. Aha. <laughs> Waterproof tape. I didn't know they made this. Oh, these cool are like floaties. pool floaties. Yeah, we can put these on the on the bottom. Oh, yeah, they're like, uh, yeah, they're already split in half for us. Easy. Let's get let's get four of them. Hey, I feel pretty confident. All right, we were raised in the water. You know, me and Ash. Yeah. Well, mostly me, but. Well, me too. You know, me too. Bro, I've been looking for Don yeah. everywhere. He said he was getting supplies. I don't know where he is. Don. Oh my gosh. Dom. Okay, okay. Oh, I'm sorry. We I'm have sorry, no time to waste. You're right, you're right. Oh Dude, my such god. A comfy couch. What the heck? I don't care. We need to find supplies. It's, right, it's out of our price range. $137. Not bad. So that means. Oh, wait, wait, actually. I need the Red Bull. Thank you. Okay. All right, and because I'm pretty sure we have a little bit left over money, we're gonna put the American flag on the back. I this mean, is a legit not, boat. Not only do we have the best boat, but now it looks the coolest too. So. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Dude, I'm starting to get nervous that like, we might be over budget. I think so too. We literally don't know how much these pool noodles cost. We are running out of time. We have to build. All right, we're gonna use our handy dandy tool. Scan. All right. Oh, the buckets are only four dollars. That's Dude, perfect. That's literally perfect. We're gonna have we're gonna have money to spare. Dude, one thirteen. We have more money we could spend, but honestly, I think I think I'm good. Like I feel like we're we're gonna be good to go. I think we're perfect. Okay, let's all get right. Up, bro. <laughs> all right, guys. I think we got everything to make our boat. So let's go check out. Look at them. They don't know what they're doing. Haha. <laughs> L. 
Brian, you looking for these? No, we don't. We already got them right here, buddy. All right, we're good. All right, I think it's time to start building. They're trying to chirp us right now, but all I see over there is a bunch of pool floaties in Home Depot buckets. Our total bill was $198, right underneath the $200 threshold. Whoop, whoop. Nice job, Let's Ashton. Go. That's what I call teamwork. Not only is our bucket afloat, but we just got right under the spending limit. Let's go. Let's get back to the house and let's start making this boat. You know, we thought ahead just in case Brian is stranded out in that pool for a long time. He'll survive. Or maybe I'll just keep it. Yeah, I'll just keep it. That looks like the worst boat I've ever seen in my life. Why didn't you get grass? Why do you have rope? Why do you have noodles? We got hot Cheetos. You better give me some of those. No! You better give me some of those hot no! Cheetos. No! Ah! Thought you crossed the line, buddy. Come on, go, go, go. This is not yours. This is ours. Oh. Not yours. Ours is over here. This is the third time you tried to cheat. Third time. All right, so first things first, we gotta design the boat. Tops on the bed. I'd say we tape with that, and then we go over it with the waterproof. Smart. That's why we're teammates. Here we go. So once Brent is done taping, this is basically the layout we're going for. It just has to be on the water after. All right, we gotta go. Yes, I will do the oar. Okay. Yeah. This is the boat. She believes in me. I'm counting on you, okay, bud? That's my biggest supporter right there. I love you. Oh. Hey. I love you too, sugar. What are you doing yeah. in my room? Okay, wait, wait. Uh, I got to stab the plastic with our box cutter. <laughs> I am zip tying a broom thing on a pipe. <laughs> We're not doing oh, too on. good. Uh, on. Well, watch us win. I don't think the other teams know what they're doing. They're like, they don't even like know how to build anything. And they have such a tiny boat over there. It's like so small. Hey, hey. About size, about the motion in yeah. the ocean. <laughs> so this is the waterproof tape. It smells like crap, but it will, it will get the job done. Waterproof tape. Hell, haha, <laughs> disaster. Come on, let's go. All right, so far so good. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah. Now for the buckets. Wait, wait, Dom, I think we should add some floaties right here. Like underneath. Oh, we so can do that. Let's cut some small ones for four small ones. This is working. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Clean <Bro>. cut. Oh. <laughs> I'm like, I, I'm surprising myself with my strength here. So I'm trying to zip tie this. It's just not staying. I guess rope it is. Do you like the view? <laughs> what are you doing with the broom? My eyes. Liv, we have a problem. What? You broke it? I broke the box cutter. Are you freaking kidding me? It's stuck in. Dude! It's stuck in. No! Good thing we have a plan B. We don't have a plan B. <laughs> we'll, we'll figure something out. I'm gonna go see if anyone it's else tough, has huh? something I can use. Hey, 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 get out of here. No. What's going on over here? Um, yeah. I have a question. Nope. What? It's gonna cost. Ashton. I know she wants. She wants a tape, Dom. We're here. reselling. Oh, guys, I've been really sad. Can I just have a hug? You no. didn't buy tape? No, I don't want to hug. Ashton, can I please? I don't want to hug because the pool's in free. Can I? <laughs> Wait. What are you trying to wait. do? <laughs> wait. No, wait. we need this. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> She is real. All right, I'm gonna use this yeah, one bro. I don't even know where the start is, but I'm just, we don't have time. If you guys remember, the buckets were my idea, so hopefully this works. Oh, please don't tell Ashen. Okay, you know what, uh, we don't need this. Done, that is not gonna be enough. We need to duct tape the whole thing. What? We're gonna sink. No, no, it's, no water will get in here. Yeah, like that, there we go. Okay, so it looks like we only have 15 minutes left. Oh my 15. gosh, 15 okay, minutes. Okay, so we, we gotta go. go what are you doing? Plan B, we're actually gonna duct tape the entire boat disaster. around. Because everything is better with duct tape. I was actually a Boy Scout back in the day. That's a Girl Scout. No See some popcorn, I saw cookies. Now, Oh, look, this might be hey, perfect. Look, this can fit right, right in here. Crash. Yo, what is this? This looks That's kind of genius. Oh. Hey, can you get out of here? Bro, that looks like trash. Bro, what is this? This looks that terrible. Looks oh, it looks bad. <laughs> yeah, right. While Brent gets distracted by the others, I'm gonna keep grinding. I'm not losing this. Okay, so I'm looking around at the other boats and they actually look terrible. Our boat looks way better than everyone. We're doing big things over here with the waterproof tape. Yeah, I don't think anyone else thought to get waterproof tape. I think we're the only one. We're going hard. Now we're gonna tape this blue one on the bottom. Honestly, it might be better like here. That's because then it's gonna be unstable and uneven. We don't want to tip over. That's our main. I think thing. we should just cut some. Things. I think Dom is right. I think it's gonna be a little bit too unstable. We have to. And honestly, I think the I think the buckets are much more helpful than those. I feel like we should get the buckets on right now. Liv, you know what I'm thinking? What? We gotta put the lids on. Wait. All right, ten minutes. Yeah. I gotta restart this entire thing because we didn't put the lids on, and then it's not gonna float. Should we put these on the edges? 
We gotta take the sticky part off. Yeah, this is sticky. Oh. Yeah, oh, here. Right. Let me just, here. That's actually pretty sticky. Yeah. It's a little bit sticky. <laughs> How much duct tape is too much duct tape? I say the more the merrier. We gotta. Oh, yeah. Look how many That's right. That's, that's that one right there. What? <laughs> what? That's where you got the broom for? Are you serious? Yeah, just to mess with you. You're running out of time. I don't even see a boat over there. Uh huh. I see a disaster. <laughs> I'm adding the tape to the rope. That way, it doesn't go anywhere. And then last but not least, we're gonna wrap it around the entire place. Hey! What hey. is happening? Uh -huh. Joke's on you, we don't even need it. Hey, hey, that is not allowed. Those are my, those are my noodles. Right. Get him, get him. So basically, the box cutter got stuck in the boat. Yeah, so it's really not safe at this point. So we don't want Brian to get stabbed. So I'm going to duct tape over the blade. I never really thought I'd be building a boat ever in my life. I think we still have a chance of winning this, right? I think so. Maybe we should start saying, yeah, I know so. Yeah, we're going to win. Okay, so something that might help our boat stay afloat is some pretty decorations. And this is really where I come in, is making things look nice, not so much the building. Let's find some nice things, you know, like that. Uh, plants, perhaps. Yeah. This this little guy. Oh my gosh, perfect. Perfect. I was looking for flowers. This is great. All right. This is good. This is good. Let's let's go. I bring decorations. Dude, there's literally five minutes left. We, start, we need to start wrapping this, bro. Got it. This is embarrassing. Nah, this is it. Oh yeah. Oh, that's that's fur. I see this team over here struggling with their pool noodles, but we got the pre-cut ones. We were all prepared, and look at them over there. All right, moment of truth, we're gonna flip it over. Now that's a sturdy. It's just this, and then the turf, and then we're done. Keep going, Dom, make sure we press it down. Once we win the challenge, we should put this in the ocean, and yeah, we should use the sharks every weekend. Yeah. Wait, Dom, you almost forgot to add? Oh, our American flag. <laughs> we gotta tape it. This is literally the final piece we needed. Oh, yeah. 45 seconds. Oh! 45 seconds. What does this look like? Something It looks like sent. a funeral. Yeah, that like died, and I'm gonna send it off in the ocean. What is yours have a flag? Huh? It's America. We literally finished within like 15 seconds left. Guys, seconds we're done. What are they doing? They're so worried about bro, how it's gonna look. Exactly. How is that gonna help it flow, bro? That is bro? not gonna help you, Brent. I'm sorry. Bro, you're just jealous that ours looks the best, dog. Honestly, yeah. I'm kind of proud of ours. Yeah. Yeah. You got a speaker? Yeah, dude, I picked this thing up. That's actually cool. Dude, we're gonna be bumping tunes, we're gonna be on the water, and we're gonna be tanning. Yeah, let's be nice. 10, nine, eight, seven, L, five, four, Two, one, time! Hey, that's time, that's time, that's time. That's what I call a boat. Where's the coffin? Like, I'm yeah. talking. Go away. Yeah. What is that? That's our unsinkable masterpiece. Yeah. What do you mean? Unsinkable. A trash can. No, it's not. Yeah, it's, it's literally the This is the ugliest the best. thing I've ever seen. We did the math, we ran the numbers, and there was literally a 0% chance this will sink. Ours is pretty, and it's gonna float. I'm feeling so. pretty good about this. We even have a four. Yeah, who thought of that? All right, Don, do you realize that their pool noodles are literally not attached on duct tape? They're hanging on yeah. by a thread. What are they doing? Theirs is gonna sink. It looks good. cool, but we're winning. We got it, we got it, let's go. They have some leftover <laughs> pool noodles. <laughs> looks like nobody's claiming these. Hey, hey, we're done. Hey, we're done. Oh my gosh, we have some color. I love it, it looks great. Wait, what's our ship called? The holy ship. The holy ship. With a P, the holy ship. This is the Paradiso. That's when you take the Paradiso, when you wanna chill, relax. So this is the little Mayflower. Yep. We're calling it that because we, you could literally transport anyone across huh? the seas in this and they'd be totally fine. And you can put your goods inside the buckets. Exactly. Yeah. You can literally travel to America on this thing. All right, we had 20 minutes to build our boats and now it is time for the final part of this video. We're gonna see if these things actually float and who floats the longest. I mean, Let's yours go. will, ours will. All right, well, we'll see. Are you guys ready to meet the judges? Yes. Let's go. Yeah. All right. Lex, I mean, uh, Pearson and Andy. <laughs> 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 The judges have arrived. Hello, They're guys. Hey, guys. They are tough. Hey, guys. They are going to choose you. Hey. Hey. Oh, hey. Hey. Okay. Sorry, guys. Oh, oh, yeah. is that color yeah. is perfect. I, ow. That's oh, awesome. ow. Ow. Right. Oh, no. Ducky. So, the judges thought that we couldn't just go in a, a pool to do this. They thought it'd be cool to do an ice pool. Literally. <laughs> what? What? Literally yeah. cool. So they brought in a, bu a bunch of ice to put in the pool. So good oh for you guys. Wait, what is that? Oh, that was such a mistake. Oh, God, this is heavy. <laughs> okay, so obviously we can't just look at your guys' floats and know if they will sink or not. I mean, so we, we have, Well. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so we have four different challenges, and the first one being 
Will it float? All right. Yep. Let's see, guys. Let's test it out. Let's see. You actually don't worry about the ice water, right? Because y'all are confident in y'all's boats. All right. So what everyone's gonna do is they're gonna put their floats into the pool, and whoever sinks loses. And if they all sink, we keep the money. Actually. Hey, what are we doing with the money? Uh, I know we are sink. going to Omnia in Vegas. Ooh, okay, <laughs> on a PJ. All right. Oh, we're not going to sink. Like, like we're not sinking at all. I don't know what why you're talking about. about. All right, ready? And in three, two, two one. one. Let it rip. Oh, 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 yeah. oh, baby. Okay, so all of the floats appear to be floating. Nice, guys. They're doing their job. But the real test is if it will float with a person on it. And in three, two, one. Step into your float. You got it, you got it, you got it, you got it. Oh, okay. Slow and steady. All right. Oh! It looks like Ashley's on. Oh! He made it like Ashley's pretty good. We're up. Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Hey, get your feet off the side, buddy. Just, but just Brian's got it. the best mode of transportation. Yeah. You know, That's he's ever I in a... Oh, 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 no! Oh, my God! Oh, yes! Oh, wow. Oh, I think he's going to win. That is wow. so cool. Looks right. like Ashton oh. number one is out. Hi, hey, hey, you obviously fell in the water. You are out. No, what? no, no. We get hang a on, hang on. Right. Hang on. The judges need to speak for a second. <laughs> Very good. Okay, so the judges have made a decision. Dom and Ashton, we will give you one chance. If you can get back onto the float and not let it sink, you can get on it any way that you want. All right. Gentlemen, in three, two, one, get in the float. This is your last chance. Go. Go. Oh, oh, my God. God. Oh, no. Oh, no. This is, I thought it was unthinkable. We shouldn't have called it the Titanic something. Dom. I think it's only fair if Dom gets pushed in the pool as well. Wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, he worked hard on this. It appears that there are still two floats remaining. Okay, and you know what? They both look pretty sturdy. I just ran into the team's sunken boat right here. Look at this failure. How does it feel, guys, that you failed this challenge so fast? How does it feel to spend over the limit? I spent 198. You spent 198? 200. Okay, so here's the next challenge. We've got water balloons and water guns, but we're not gonna tell them what the next challenge is. We're just gonna get going for it. All right. Brian, do you think you're the underdog here? I, I think so. Really? I mean. Oh, oh my. Oh my God. Oh, oh wait, 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 wait. Oh, 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 What if I put pressure on the back of his boat and then flip it? There you go. Yeah, just be sprawled out on this thing. Yeah. Our strategy is we have the area. Really give it your all. You can even stand and hit him in the head. Yeah. Here's a water balloon. Thank you. All right, gentlemen, your weapons. Wait till I say begin. 
fine, no fun. <laughs> no, boys. And hey. in three, we got this, Ashton. Two, got it. one, fight to the death. Oh my oh. God! Right away. Don't let him do that. Don't let him do this. This is for a thousand dollars. Oh, thousand dollars on the line. Oh, oh, oh. This right now. It, I'll buy it. Today we're doing three different challenges from carving to painting to baking. Two players will compete to make an item from a store, then both players will swap items and try to figure out what the other player made. Welcome to the styrofoam carving challenge. Right here we have styrofoam and we have a carving kit where Brett and I will use these objects to craft an object, okay? We've got 15 minutes to do it. 15 minutes. And can you do that? I've, I've only carved a pumpkin before. Oh my god, a novice. This is gonna be actually low key satisfying. No, I'm really excited. We have to carve whatever we're gonna get. Now we have to figure out what store we're gonna buy these objects from. Please be an expensive, expensive apple store, store. Apple store, apple store, apple, apple store, apple store. Target. Okay. Wait, that's kind of good. They have apple products there. Oh my gosh, there are so many options running through my head right now. Name five things you can buy from Target. Frosted flakes. Grapes. Grapes. I don't know, grapes are on my mind right now. Prime. Prime, okay. Uh, a bicycle. A bicycle. Uh huh. And scooter. Scooter. Wow. Yeah. You think you can craft any of those into this styrofoam? Oh, block? I for sure can. I don't know about that. He's not 15 super minutes. artistic. Right. What? Sorry. 15 minutes starts next. All right. So first, I'm going to draw it because you have to like draw it in order to picture it so you can carve it. Uh huh. Hey. What? Are Sorry. You no, I'm just telling the viewers that I'm. I literally can hear you. What? Okay. I literally yeah. heard that. Oh my god, I think I'm- Oh my god, you do that and you die. You guys, check this out. Let's turn this bad boy on. Oh my god, this yeah. is so satisfying! Uh, what are you making? What is that? It's Spongebob. Is that like a head? Horrible, Brent. Wait, how come you're doing so good? Because I like to give 110% in everything. I am trying to get it done here. This is really hard. Like, this is actually a lot harder than I thought it would no, be. No, you're just not very good at this. Excuse you. Excuse you. All right, we've got 10 minutes left. Oh, mine is looking kind of good. Let's check this out. Yours looks like a spoon. Did you really want a spoon? Is that what you really want? Uh, me, on the other hand, we're making some freaking progress over here. All right, we have five minutes left. How did you get moving? My strategy is to get under without doing a whole lot of work. Pierce is gonna run out of time. I'm not. It should just pop out of here now. Brent, that's the third time you've said that and it's still stuck. <laughs> what the hell I was broke that? The tool. Hey, stop moving the table. Stop moving the table. I'm running out of time. I just gotta make sure that it's something that I can actually hold on to so that it's not just one big block. Okay, Brent, because there's only two minutes left, I'll help you out a little bit. All right, Brent, what you gotta do is you gotta stick it in here and then just start dragging it. That gives me no help. I'm gonna do some finishing touches. Brent, we have one minute left. We have one minute left. Oh crap, I melted part of the power. Brent, we have 30 seconds left, and if you don't get whatever the hell that is out of your block of styrofoam, I am just gonna buy you styrofoam. I was ready a minute ago, but I'm just adding some extra details because he's taking so dang long. All right, we got 15 seconds. All right, I'm doing my final touches. Five, four, three. Ah! Two. Oh my god, oh my god. One. Boom. What in the world is that? You know what this is. No, I don't. Pearson, come on. You know what this is. It looks like one big spoon to me. Okay, you know what? Looking at this, I I, I think I might have a, an idea. Oh, you know what that is. All right, well, it's time to swap items, guess what the other one made, and head to Target. All right, sounds good. Okay, so we're now at Target, and we're gonna try and pick out what the other person crafted. Okay, so do you know what that is? I, I'm gonna make some guesses. You better know what that is. I'm gonna, I'm gonna do my best. Okay, well, I know, I know what this is, Pearson. I already know what it is, okay, so. Okay, beautiful. So, I'm hey, excited. I got you. I'm excited. I got you, right, okay? Let's go inside. I have to find an object that looks similar to what what Brent has made. I have a couple ideas of what this could be, so I'm just gonna look around and see if I can find something that looks a little something like this. Okay, so this is Pearson's. Honestly, if I had to guess, it's definitely a book, right? Wouldn't you say so? Okay, so I am in the dog section, and I know Brent doesn't have a dog right now, but maybe he's thinking about getting one and he needs a slicker brush. Kinda similar, I'm not gonna lie. I'm gonna be honest, I don't think 
this is it. Let's keep moving. Okay, kind of looks similar. I know what she's trying to do. She's trying to get an iPad out of me. I mean, I'm not gonna let her pull a fast one because she doesn't deserve an iPad. So let's find something that looks like this that's not an iPad because iPads are expensive. Okay, so I've just tried to flip it upside down just to see what it would be. And it looks like this could be something as well. Maybe a vase. If this was just a little bit longer, it could be the same, right? But also Brent doesn't even need a vase. I don't think he knows anything about home decorating. So this is probably not it. <laughs> oh, a calculator. Okay, that, that looks pretty similar, wouldn't you say? Oh, should it be like a big one, like this one? She carved this. This is a mini printing calculator. And I think they look pretty similar. What do you think? We're gonna get this. And she's gonna probably be so mad because she thought she was getting an iPad. Brent has been nonstop talking about pickleball for the last three months. Sure, it's not perfect, but you know, that's just Brent not being very artistic. No wonder he would carve this out. This is fucking expensive. You know what? I found your pickleball paddle. You're welcome, Brent. Okay, so Brent drew this and carved out this, and so I bought this. She got exactly what I wanted. What is it? It's a pickleball paddle. Uh-huh. How yeah. much was it? It was $100. Oh. Not including tax. Thank you. Yeah, I'm expecting my iPad now. This was an iPad? Why is he looking shocked? I thought this was a calculator. Are you joking? It's the one that you... prints out the receipts. Brent, I did not just spend $100 on your freaking pickleball paddle for me to get a calculator this was that I won't even use. This is not a calculator. Have fun with your calculator. Um, no, no, no. I'm gonna go play some no, pickleball. No, no. Thank you, you know what? Pearson. You give me that back. You know what? The only paddle you should have is this one. Brent? This is the pancake art challenge. Dom and I have 15 minutes to make anything we want out of pancakes. At the end of the 15 minutes, we're gonna swap pancakes and try to guess what the other person made. But first, let's see what store we get. Here, you can go ahead and oh. pick the, pick the, oh, 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 the oh. honors. Whoa, whoa, this is so much pressure. What do we have here? Here we go. Oh, <laughs> Best Buy. That's actually like literally perfect. There's so many expensive things that are sold at Best Buy. I hope I get a flat screen TV. Dude, I have so many things in mind right now. All right, let's do it. Let's do it. So when do we start? Uh, three, two, one, right now. Oh. Okay, I need this, okay. this. Oh wait, I need to turn this on actually. Okay, how hot do you make a pan to make pancake? Pretty hot. Wait, that's why it's called a pancake. Cause it's a cake you make on a pan. Bruh. Did you just find this oh out? Oh my God, I literally never thought of that before. I'm pretty sure this is my first time ever even making a pancake at all. You never made a pancake? I don't think I've ever made pancakes. What? Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> but do you like pancakes or waffles better? I'm more of a waffle guy myself. Dude, what are you making? What is it? You that? can't tell? It looks like a weird, Purplish black. Okay, well, archway. don't pay attention to the color, although they could be this color, but imagine this was black. I think I'm done, actually. All right, let me see. Let's turn up the heat on this bad boy. Let's get it cooking. Let's not burn it. Oh, it's bubbling. Wait, no, hold on. I'm going to add on to it. I'm going to turn this down. I'm not ready for you yet. I've never seen Dom this focused before. Dude, that looks so good. I don't know if I'm going to have enough for this. Is that mustard? What is that? Dude, it is so obvious what that is. I have bro. no idea what I that is. I promise you, every single person watching right now knows exactly what I'm making. That is that is so scary. That is so creepy. I don't want to go to Best Buy and find out what that is. <laughs> we have five minutes left. Remember, we still have to flip these and not destroy them. Otherwise, you know, it's not actually a real pancake. Are you going to do it? Gotta, you go first. I'm, I'm going to just watch you do it. I'm so scared it's going to fall apart. I feel like it's going to break. Oh! oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, oh no, I'm not going to help you. Oh, it's stuck to my thing. It's stuck. It's What do I do? It's stuck. <laughs> I don't know. It is not ready. <laughs> Careful. We're gonna, we're gonna leave it alone for just a second. Now my guy looks like he's going through puberty. Apparently when you make pancakes, you're supposed to butter the pan before you make them. Didn't do that. And now it's a little stuck. I feel like I could pick it up and play with it. Careful, careful. You're gonna burn yourself. And flip. Yeah. Pretty good. <laughs> that was not bad. We got a little bit of damage, but that was not bad. My guy's kind of scaring me right now. <laughs> he I, looks dude, a how little terrifying. Gonna, how are we gonna flip that? <laughs> I don't know. Okay, I'm just gonna go for it. One, two, three. No way. Oh! Yes! So good. <laughs> that was really good. Heck? I should have done that. We're gonna flip our pancakes to the saran wrap. Take no. Oh no! Oh my gosh, it's on the edge. It's on the edge. It's gonna fall off. Oh my god, it's so close to breaking. How am I supposed to figure out what that is if you broke it in half? Dude, it's so obvious. Come on, look at it. Just give it a good look right now. I have no idea what Jeez. that is. All right, here's my masterpiece. I think I did pretty good. This is my pancake. I literally don't think I could have made it better. Like this is the best I think I can do. Okay, let's go to Best Buy. All right, let's go. All right, we're at Best Buy. Um, it's time for us to switch. Good luck. Let, let, oh. Good luck. Dude, what? <laughs> what? How am I supposed to find this? I don't know how I'm supposed to figure out what this is when it's cracked down the middle. Dom really does not know how to cook a pancake or anything else for that matter. So this is either earmuffs or headphones. I honestly have no idea. Considering we are at Best Buy, I would assume that it's 
probably headphones, right? All right, let's go find some headphones. I know what this is. It's a Nintendo Switch, I think. I'm not a gamer, but uh, pretty sure my nephew has one of these. Maybe I could just say that Dom made one of these. I need a new hairbrush. Uh, that's not gonna work. She didn't really specify what kind of headphones she wants, but these do look big and bulky. Dude, spot the difference, for real. This is probably what she wants. This is what you want, right? Here, try these on. No, that's her. God, please, no! <laughs> this isn't it. What do you mean? It's so close, but it's not it. <laughs> yes, it is, no, it's the same thing. It's not. Bro, what else are you looking for? You're close, you're hot. All right, let's move on. Well, turns out they were sold out of Nintendo Switches. You did know what it was. It's a Nintendo I Switch. Knew it, bro, everyone knows what a Nintendo Switch is. Yeah, I was messing with you. It's pretty obvious. <laughs> yeah. I definitely got yours too, right? I showed you in the store. No, you didn't get mine right, and you don't get my delicious pancake. Wait, what? Yours actually looks way better. Wait, let me see. No, no. Mmm. <laughs> That's pretty good, actually. I can't believe you just did that. <laughs> well, if I'm not gonna get them right, then. So you got mine right. Where's my Nintendo Switch? Yeah. They're sold out. What, Liv, There's are you serious? Out. Nothing I can do about it. I'll just play on this, that's fine. This is the painting challenge. Andrew and I have 10 minutes to paint something that we want from a store, but first we have to find out what store. So here we go. We can paint anything we want if they sell it at this store, and the store is Walmart. Walmart, you used to go in there all the time. I've actually never been no, to Walmart. No, Lexi goes there all the time. All right, 10 minutes starts now. That's not fair though, because like Lexi knows what's at Walmart. She goes there all the time. So well, you like, used to work there. So you actually know the inventory better than I do. You used to be my freaking guest there every day. You used to go there every single day. Yes. Yeah, you were there way longer than I worked. You didn't even work there and you were there longer than me. I was the boss at Walmart. Hey. Yeah, you would be the boss at Walmart. You would. <laughs> Worked at JC Penny, dude. Dude, you always get it wrong. It's TJ Maxx. You literally worked at TJ Maxx. I used to work at the snack bar. At the snack bar at the hot. That's the dumbest thing I've ever heard in my life. Talk about your job at JC Penny. My job at TJ Maxx. It was fun. The way I got it was because a lot of my friends worked there, like most of my friends. And yeah. Literally the first day I went and applied, she was like, when can you start? Like right away. They must have really needed. I could start like whenever. I volunteered at the snack bar. She literally like spawned in and was already in a YouTube video with a friend. And that's actually true. I've technically been working since I was like 10. There's five minutes left. Mine's looking really good. Oh, also like, you know, like that was my first job. So what about you? Like, you never actually had a job though, huh? I volunteered at the snack bar that my brothers would play at. And I would tell people that my name was Rose. Why? Why would you do that? Like, no, it was weird. Like, Rose? I really like, you wanted were like... my name to be Rose that I would lie. All right, there's three minutes left. Mine's looking really good. Oh, really? So I have a feeling I'm gonna get exactly what I want. Do you think I'm, I'd be able to tell what you're drawing though? Yeah. Really? I'm done. Andrew, you have one minute left. Holy crap, I really didn't do that much. <laughs> like, I was just distracted Ooh. trying to roast you. 30 seconds. Hurry. Five, four, three, two, one. Brush is down. Okay, our 10 minutes is up. Paintings are done. But now Andrew and I are gonna head to Walmart and try and guess what each other painted. Let's do it. We just got to Walmart and we have 10 minutes to find what the other person drew. Hopefully I could tell what Lexi painted on this because she's not the best painter. I was gonna say the same Let's thing go. about you. Oh, really? It's pretty clear what Andrew drew. Let's head to the shoe department. I'm <laughs> just kidding. We're gonna head to the electronic department, Ooh. obviously. Take a look at Lexi's painting. It could be either an aquarium, but it could also be a TV. This isn't an iPhone. This is is clearly an Apple phone case. I'm gonna be getting Andrew an Apple phone case and he's gonna be happy with it. Obviously, I think it's a TV, but we don't wanna make it that easy. We wanna get her something that's kind of similar to it and troll her a little bit. So I've been walking around the electronics aisle and I cannot find an iPhone, but this is the closest thing I found to it. That's right, an Apple iPhone case. If she really wanted a TV, she should have made it a little obvious, put like a remote controller on the side and maybe wrote TV. So Andrew wasn't very specific with his painting, so I got him an iPhone case. I mean, they look pretty similar. Close enough. Okay, so Lexi wasn't super specific about what type of TV. She didn't say a large flat screen TV. She didn't say any of that. This literally could be any TV, could be a fake TV. And I see one over here that looks pretty similar. It's a little screen right here that looks pretty similar to that. So if we really wanted to, we could save a lot of money and just get a $34 set that has a TV inside. Still counts, still a TV. All right, let's get this for her. I'm sure she'll still like it. Bluey's Beach Cabin, that's fine. This is what Andrew drew, and Andrew, this is what I got you. A phone case? Yeah. Let's see, ask for an iPhone. Well, you need to be more specific than that. This just what shows- What do you mean? That's an iPhone on, on there that I painted. You don't get everything you want in this life. You want 
wanted a TV. This isn't a TV. There's two TVs in there for you. I got you two. It even comes from way more things, look, that you could play with because you're just a little Ooh. tiny itty bitty girl. You're reaching with this one. There you go. What the heck? And I'm never painting with you. Well, I guess yeah. this is not bad. It's a... If I make this bottle flip, then you guys have to be my assistants for the entire day. What, what did, did you miss? Yeah. Um, How about you have to give us a kiss? Alright, <laughs> here we go. Ready? Three, two, one. Oh, hey! What? So now we have to be your assistants. So one of you goes with me, and then one of you goes with my sister. So um, Ashton, come with me. Which one? Ah, wrong Ashton. Right, uh, Ashton, go get me Starbucks. Uh, I'm banned. You're banned? Long I'm story, I'm banned from Starbucks. I can't. I'm sorry. Go, just go figure it out. Alright, I will. All right, so I want a burger. Okay. The craziest drink you can find at Starbucks. All right. Size 17 shoes. Why do you need a size 17 shoe? You're not a size 17. I mean, if I put both of my feet together in one shoe, I will be a size 17. Do you have four feet? I'm so good. Why do you need that? Well, how, how do you know I don't want to walk on one foot? How do you know I don't want to hop? Okay. Are you my assistant? Yes, or yes, not, size bro? 17 shoe. Okay, okay. okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, well, enough complaining. Go. Okay. Wait, Brent. What? What burger? Oh, um, I want a bun from Chick-fil-A, some lettuce and onions from Subway, and of course, I want the meat patty from In-N-Out. Uh, what? The best of each, what do you mean? Come on, have fun. Okay. Hey, be quick, 20 minutes on the timer. That's it. Lexi's actually at the warehouse right now. I'm gonna go ask her if she needs anything done for her. Hopefully, she doesn't give me too much because I feel like Lexi always has a lot of stuff to do. So. Hey, Lexi. Hey, I'm gonna be your assistant today. Oh, lucky me. You actually caught me at a good time. It's lunch time. It is lunch time, yes. Yeah, normally for lunch I have 10 K pops. Also 10 Baja Blast freezes. Talk about. You have to be back in 10 minutes. 10 minutes. 10, 10 K pops. Pop. 10 Baja Blast. Three, two, right. one, your time starts now. And those Baja Blast better not be melted. So to complete Brent's burger, we're gonna head over to Subway to get onions and lettuce. Why from Subway, you may ask? I have no idea. I didn't even know you can get shredded up onions. Hopefully you can. Hi, um, I was just wondering if I can get like a side of lettuce and onions. You have to pick like a salad right there. Let's do like a small salad bowl then. Yeah. Yeah, that's perfect. Thank you. Okay, so I just got the onions and lettuce from Subway. She did give me a discounted price for $5.48. So, what a sweet girl. Okay, so we just rolled up to Chick-fil-A because I'm supposed to get Brent's buns from here, but I am starving. So I'm gonna get the chicken sandwich and I'm gonna eat the chicken in the sandwich and the buns will be for Brent's burger. And he'll have no idea. Now, let's enjoy the chicken and give the buns to Brent. Here are the buns and I'm not gonna lie, they're soggy. Uh, Brent is not gonna be happy about this. So we finally just made it to In-N-Out because to complete Brent's burger, we need to get the patties. So what better way to get the patties than In-N-Out? So we're gonna get two patties to make it a double-double. Can I just get like, just two patties? Yeah, of course. Cool. All right, it's gonna be 269. Uh, okay. Now we've got our patties, so let's go assemble it to get Brent his ultimate burger. So Lexi wanted 10 different K-Pops. I think that's a bit absurd. I don't know why she wants 10 K-Pops, but here we are. Hello, can I please do 10 K-Pops, please? Yeah. yeah. Yeah, that just cost me like 40 bucks. So that, I really hope Lexi eats all of these or else it's just gonna be a big waste. Now we gotta go over to Taco Bell to get the Baja Blast. Let's go. So now we are at Burlington Factory. I've never been here, but out of all the stores here, this place has to have some sort of shoes. Also, Brent wants a size 17 shoe. I don't know why you're not a size 17, Brent. So like, why do you want that? It doesn't make sense. I'm currently looking at all the tags. The highest they have right now looks like it's a size 12. Wait. This looks pretty good. 17. I mean, yeah, that looks pretty legit. And let's go check out because we have no time to waste. The shoes are secured and these are massive. All right, guys, we just made it to Taco Bell. We're going to order 10 Baja Blasts for Lexi right now. I feel like they're going to look at me like I'm crazy. Hi, can I please do 10 Baja Blasts, please? 10 Baja Blasts? Yes. Oh my gosh, bro. I don't even know where to put these. Like, there's too many of them. <laughs> All right, Lexi, we got your Baja Blast and we're coming. The line to get Brent's pink drink is so long. Come on, guys, Brent scares me. Please, I need to get his drink. One hour later. Hey, pink drink from Starbucks and the shoes. Ashton, what? I don't like pink drinks. Brent, that's the best. Brent, thank you for the shoes. So now we have to assemble Brent's burger. So we take out these buns. 
Oh wow. And it's time to put our patties on the buns and then let's throw on our onions, some pickles, and last but not least, our lettuce. And this is what a $15 burger looks like. Oh wow. Now let's go present it to Brent. Brent, lunch time. Oh, uh, there is your hamburger. Look, where's the cheese? You didn't say you wanted cheese. What do you mean I didn't say? I, I, I obviously said cheese. You didn't say it at all. No, I said cheese burger. There's always cheese on a cheeseburger. Yeah, right back. Thank you. You're welcome. How did I forget the cheese? So it's been about 15 minutes. I went over the 10 minute mark and all these Baja Blasts are melted now. So hopefully she doesn't fire me. This is my first time being an assistant. I gotta get these into her. Let's go. I'm here. Wow, okay, you made it. 10 shake pops and 10 Baja Blasts. Let's do a taste test. It's not bad. See, I mean, it's a cake pop. You have them every day, right? There's no ice in here. Hot. They're all melted. It's a hot day, Lexi. I don't know what you want me to do. Ashton, these are supposed to be freezing. They were in my car and okay. they overheated. You know what? I don't need an assistant right now. I'm not really looking for an assistant. But you know who is? Dom. No, you don't have to take it. Leave those. Take no, you're going to leave those. Thank you. Worst assistant ever. I'm here for the second time because who would have thought Brent wants cheese on the patties? How was I supposed to know that? Can I do um two cheeseburger patties? Just like, just the patties cheese. with cheese. Yeah. yeah, thank you. Okay, so we have to hurry because Brent wanted cheese and there's no time to waste. Brent told me I messed up the order, but take off these and put the cheese ones on. Okay, okay. And I'm just gonna grab all of this. Okay, let's go. What are you, Brett, what are you doing? Ashley, you took way too long. I just doored ass sushi. You are literally the worst assistant ever. Go and be like Pearson's assistant or something. You know what, fine, I will. Bye. Okay, to Pearson we go. We just made it over to Dom's house, so let's see if he's home. Hey Dom. Yo, what's up? What's up, dude? I was Lexi's assistant, Okay. but she kind of got over me. Over you? Yeah, she didn't want me anymore. So she sent me over here. Is there anything you need done? I mean, if you follow me to my room, I was gonna do my laundry today, but I guess if you're here, you can just do it, right? Yeah, dude, I got you. Right, okay. right over there, yeah, just All right. the first one. I'll left. make sure to get this started for you. Awesome, thank you, bro. Yeah, of course. So apparently Ashton will do literally anything I ask him to do. I feel like that's not true, so I'm gonna make him a list of some pretty unbearable tasks. There's no way he actually does all this stuff. All right, number one, I actually am pretty hungry, so I'm gonna say go to Arby's and buy me the meat mountain. Number two, I'm gonna say buy me Skittles, but only the red ones. Number three, I wanted to print out a picture of Brent, go to the store and have it framed. This one is gonna be really embarrassing. <laughs> so I got you this list of a couple different things I want you to do, okay. um, and you can't come back until you complete this entire list. I'll see you in, what, like 20 minutes? 20 minutes, I got you. Really? <laughs> we made it to Pearson's. Hey. You didn't cut it with Brent, did you? How'd you know about that? Word travels fast around here. Oh my gosh. Come on in! So I've got a lot of things that I need from you today. Okay. Are you ready? I hope. Let's get started. All right, so first things first, I need you to mm -hmm. wax my board, my surfboard. I can handle it. I need you to get me a crustless pizza, okay? okay. Because I'm, I'm gluten intolerant and I just need as little gluten as possible. Got so it. no crust. Yeah. And then the other thing is just take my dog Gizmo out for a walk. Easy enough. Okay, all right. right. All I right. believe in you. Thanks, Here we go. We had a rough start, but it's all up from here. Where to go up? Hey, we're Let's going up. Okay, so we just made it over to Arby's. Dom said he wanted the meat mountain. I don't know what that is. I think he might be messing with me, but we're here. So let's go inside and ask. Okay, so I just looked it up. Apparently it's a real thing. Look at this. I think it has like every meat you can name on it, bro. Okay, well, let's go get it. So I just looked up the nearest surf shop. Allegedly this place has wax, whatever that is. I don't really know what that means, but let's go check it out and see if we can get some wax. You guys have wax? I guess like any type, like that's good for like a surfboard. Do you need base coat? What's base coat? Thank you. So he told me to get something called base coat. I'm not sure what that is. I'm gonna have to do some research. Who would have known that waxing a surfboard could be so hard? It's been taking forever. How's it so going? it's going great. All right. It's great. Wait, are you using this wax? Yeah. This one's for the tropics. So tropical. Like, yeah, it smells good. This is not a tropical location. I know it smells great, but we're supposed to be using the, the cold wax for cold water, not hot wax for hot water, because this is just gonna completely wipe off in the ocean. So um, you're telling me I use the wrong wax? Yeah, on this whole. Bro. Yeah. So you know what? We can just dig. It's fine. 
This is going so much better than it was for Brent. I mean, I'm gonna be Pearson's assistant every day now. Okay guys, we're here at Target. We have to get a picture frame and we have to get red Skittles. We just found the picture frames. You think a picture of Brent would go in there? I think it'll work out. Now for the most annoying part, Dom specifically said he wants Skittles, but only red Skittles. And there's no way you can buy only red Skittles. So I'm gonna have to buy Skittles and separate them by color. This is the biggest bag of Skittles that they have right here. I don't know if this is gonna be enough. So let's grab like three or four of these. Something like this. Now we are printing out the picture of Brent for Dom. I decided to go with this sexy photo of Brent right here. How does that look, guys? I think that looks perfect. Dom's gonna love it. So I don't know what a crustless pizza means. This is not crustless, but we can compromise. This is honestly not the best knife. A one down, a million to go. Now what do you do with all this crust, you may ask? You throw it in there. I cannot believe this is what Pearson wanted, but uh, let's go serve it to her. Pearson. Oh my God, I'm so hungry. You're welcome. Thank you so much. What, what did you do? Did you rip it off yourself? It's crustless. They have crustless pizza at Little Caesars. Why wouldn't you just order that? I'm confused. <laughs> this is like the saddest pizza I've ever no, seen. No, Pearson, it's good, it's fair. I promise. <laughs> okay, it's pretty good. See? But that was weird though. You, don't, you shouldn't do that. Pizza? I'm good, thank you. It's all yours. As my assistant, I order you to eat pizza. Mm. Hey, cheers. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. That's great. All right, well, you know, it's almost time for your next task, That's so great. I'm gonna go get Gizmo. All righty. Okay, guys, we just made it back to Dom's house. Now my job is to separate these Skittles. All right, I start picking them out. Guys, this is gonna take forever. It's been like 30 minutes since I've seen Dom last. I have separated some red Skittles out, and I think this should be enough. I'm back. No way, bro. You actually did it. Yeah. A framed picture of Brent. How would you even do this? I don't know, dude. I was sorting them for like 20 minutes. Literally but... only red Skittles. That's and... why I was a little late. I'm sorry it took me like 30 minutes. Dude, I was kidding. I thought this was going to take you like hours. Nice picture of Brent right there for you. Wow. And then here you that... go. The Meat Mountain. No way you actually found it, bro. The meat Mountain. Oh my God. <laughs> Yo! You're telling me you're gonna eat that. Oh my god, this thing is literally huge. It's huge, bro. Okay, here we go. Mmm. Mmm. That's actually pretty good. Really? Yeah. Thank you, bro. Well, yeah, I got your red Skittles, and then I don't know why you wanted this, but <laughs> I got it for you. Bro, this is so funny. I actually am very glad you came back because there is kind of a problem I ran into while you were gone. What? So I was working out, and I might have kind of dropped my AirPods in the pool, and I need you to go get them for me. Wait, your AirPods? Yeah. Are they even gonna work anymore? Yeah, they're like water. Resistant, I think. So you're actually gonna jump off the roof? Yeah, dude, I'm your assistant. Okay, man, get up there then. I can't believe he's actually doing this. All right, you ready? I'm ready. In three, two, one, send it. Oh my. <laughs> Did you get him? Yeah. <laughs> no Got way. You, dude. Thank you, bro. It still work? Because that was so much fun, I feel like Liv would have a couple of fun things for you to do as well. Okay, I'll give her a call. All right, see you later, bro. All right, Ashton, here you go. Thank you. This is Gizmo. Take good care of him, okay? And um, yeah, just take him for like a, like a mile walk and that should be good. All right, sounds good. All right, take good care of him. Just don't lose him, okay? How can I lose this? He's a guy? small guy, okay? He, he can be flighty. Look, everything's gonna be okay. All right, have so much fun, Gizzy. Come on. Bye, guys. Okay, guys, so Liv is working at the warehouse today, so we just pulled up. Hey, Liv. Okay, so I just got back from Dom's house. I was his assistant for the day. But he didn't, he didn't want me anymore, so now I was wondering if you had anything you needed done. So he didn't want you anymore because you're a bad assistant and now you want to help me. I never said I was a bad assistant. I just said he didn't need me anymore. I just wanted to come over and ask if you needed anything done. I was about to restock the uh, the Red Bull fridge. Oh, you want to? Yeah, no worries. You wanna... Go ahead. I've been having this really strong craving for Starbucks, yeah. particularly the Green Goblin drink. Hmm. Have you heard of it? I have not. It's so good. Okay. Oh, yeah. We're missing out. Yeah. Okay. So if you could get one of those. Yeah. That'd be, that'd be as great. As soon as I'm done, I'll go get one of you. Sweet. The Green Goblin drink doesn't exist. But he doesn't know that. All right, so I finished. Is there uh, anything else you need? I'm about to go to Starbucks, but I just want to make sure you don't need anything when I'm out. You could give me flowers. Flowers? They love flowers. I will come back with flowers and a Green Goblin. You got it. I don't get how Pearson could ever say I would lose a dog. I would never lose a This is not Gizmo. Who are you? Are you get Gizmo? Okay, well let's go back to Pearson because I don't know what to do or where her dog is. Okay, let's go, come on. 
Come on, baby. I still haven't found any flowers. I don't know where I would find flowers in here, but I'm just gonna keep looking and hopefully I find something. All right, guys, so we just found the flowers, finally. Pink is always a go-to for a girl, so remember that, guys. We are at the closest Starbucks to Liv's house right now. Can I please have the, the green goblin? Which one's that? I don't know, my friend sent it. Like, she told me to get it for her. Do you not have that? Let me see it. I don't know, she might be messing with me. Okay guys, I am super embarrassed. I knew she was lying to me. That was a complete joke. There's no such thing as a green goblin. So I just got her a green drink and hopefully she's okay with it. This is the new green goblin. It's a lavender matcha. We're just gonna call it the green goblin. This was literally the only green thing they have. So we had to get it. So we just got back from Starbucks and Target. I got the flowers right here. Hopefully she likes them. There is no such thing as a green goblin. Are you what? lying to me? What? You lied to me, huh? Wait, what do you mean? Bro, you know how embarrassing that was? That's weird, I, I always get it. Well, I asked so. her for whatever she has that's green, so there you go. Oh, okay. I'll take it. Sure, thanks. And then I have your flowers. Aww. Everyone deserves flowers sometimes. Thank you. All right, Liv, is there anything else uh, you need me to do? You still have me for like an hour or so. Well, you know, part of the job, I, I gotta always gotta get more subscribers. We're close to three million. Maybe you could get a sign and okay. write subscribe to Liv and uh, hold it in public. Sure. I'm so I'm doing whatever I want, Liv. I'm here to hold it up, actually. Let's do it. It's already been like 20 minutes. She had to have gained like a couple of subscribers from that. I'm already getting so tired and it's super hot. We're gonna go in and check on her subscriber count. Did yes. you gain subscribers? Let's check. Um, I was out there for like 20 minutes. Plus zero. You're joking. Listen, um, I appreciate your help, but I... I don't think that this is gonna work. Nobody subscribed. You must have done something I wrong. You, I don't know I what you said, you but you were supposed to get me subscribers. I brought, I brought you flowers. The wrong drink. The flowers were not roses. When a girl asks for flowers, it's roses. I'm done. Get out. You're done. We're inspired. Pearson. Is Who the hell is that? You lost my dog? Well, you lost my dog. No, 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 not. All right, so I'm just going to. Um, wait, wait, wait. I'm just going to take oh, this. Hey, Hi, hey. sugar. Uh, get, get out of my house. Okay. Yeah, you're fired, buddy. Uh, uh, 